So we've, we've kind of said back to basics and we, I totally agree with you, with, you know, as the biggest glyphosate supplier in the world, not just the UK, you know, we see a lot of people forgetting how to use glyphosate correctly, be it they've never known because they're maybe new agronomists in yeah, and that basic yeah. training hasn't been there, or people have forgotten. We've seen it with, you know, certainly last season more than this one about people extend using applications to extend extension. Yeah. That, so what do we mean by back to basics? Let's go through a few okay. best practice so, tips for glyphosate. Um, we see it straight away in the weed <coughs> screen here. Grow stage and the weed target impact on the dose that's required to get uh, robust control. Environmental conditions have a massive impact, not just on speed, but on the success uh, of glyphosate applications. Anything that's preventing the target from growing strongly is reducing the performance of glyphosate. Uh, application technique, uh, the water that you're using to spray the glyphosate, the quantity and the quality, um, these are all things that feed into uh, glyphosate performance in the field. And I mean, there are other things, obviously, from our side, product choice. You know, we have examples behind us here of a Bayer formulation, one of the, the, the almost the more simple ones, a Roundup Bioactive. Um, in here against a, a non-Bayer formulation in the product Rosate. You know, we can see there are a number of differences between the weeds and certainly between the two timings, the early and the late application we have here. Um, there are other things we can do. You mentioned about water quality. If we know we've got a serious problem, formulation can help with that. Some of the better formulations obviously have that sort of buffer built in, but if you feel you need to, you know, we can put additives in with the, in with the formulations as well to help out. You know, there are a number of things, but certainly I agree with you. Timing and dose is the other thing, dependent on what your target is. And we've got a lot of new targets, let's yeah, say, in the yeah, rotation yeah. now, haven't we, with yeah. some of these uh, mixed crop species or cover crop species that have come in that are very much at the top end of, of yeah. needing glyphosate doses. Yeah, um, absolutely. And I, I think glyphosate and performance glyphosate is something we've taken for granted. And I think that's, that's true now, not just in terms of resistance, but in glyphosate performance everywhere you know given the mixture of weeds we're trying to control and the difficult conditions that we're trying to control them in. Yeah.